for the past two months, I've been dropping twice a month. And I made 40K each month, which is good. But at the same time, bro, I'm all over the place. I'll be stressed out every day. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Sam, aka Mr. Detox. Feel me, aka Sam Got Sauce. If you don't know me, I'm gonna introduce myself. I got a brand called Detox. I started like six months ago. I'm a senior in high school, I'm 17. And yeah, I done made like, my brand done made over $100,000 since I started. So I'm, I'm just on here giving game on this YouTube channel, doing vlogs and stuff like that. Y'all go follow me on the ground. Yeah, uh, I'm, finna, I'm finna just show y'all my storage unit and stuff. And get y'all some more free game about the club the brand or just owning the business in general, really. If y'all mess with my content, subscribe and like and comment. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of May. So we got a little over a month. I'm at like 500, some right now. So yeah, if y'all mess with my content, y'all wanna see some more stuff, y'all just go ahead and subscribe and share and all that. And I'm gonna be doing different stuff besides clothing brand stuff, all that. I'm gonna give y'all more tips, game, everything. I'm gonna show y'all my brand's process on the way. Cause my brand really been growing a lot, y'all. So if y'all wanna see that, just like I said, just subscribe, stay tuned. We at the storage unit right now, y'all. We packing all these orders. I'm gonna show y'all in a minute. But it's a 10 by 20, in case y'all wondering. It costs like, it costs like 179 a month to rent. So it's pretty expensive. Well, it depends on what your budget is, you know, but you can get smaller ones for cheaper. Okay, y'all a little tour. Sweatsuits and trash is right here. We got some return hoodies right here. These are all, we finna ship these out. All our full zips are on this side. So y'all see all them full zips. We need to get more shells. Uh, we got more sweatsuits and stuff over here. All of that stuff over here. Another trash can. And then, yeah, we pack all the orders on this rug right here. We got the stickers, uh, thank you cards, shells again. We got a ring light here too, but it's charger right now. It's like a portable ring light. All the trash. Got her. Got her. <laughs> But yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty chill in here. You know, we just be coming here chill. We got internet in here too. We can watch YouTube and all that. So yeah. All right, so I'm gonna show y'all what we do when we ship. Open it up. Get this in there. Jack. Boy. <laughs> Put this on the back, seal it off. You know, make sure it's not open back up. Um, Get the bag, you know. Put that in the bag. Seal it up. Seal it up. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think I'm recording upside down. I don't know. I yeah. don't know. And then put this in here. And there you go. That's it. Put the trash in here. Put the package in there. And when this fills up, we move it over there to that little thing. So we already got one filled up for right now. But yeah, so that's how the shipping go, y'all. We be in here for hours, man. We be tired. She be mad, you know. But it's all good. Why do you Cause, cause, like a man? Cause after after this we go eat and shit. Oh, we go eat. No, we don't. Yeah, we don't. Yeah, we, we eat. I don't know what you talking about. No, I be skipping school sometime to come here. You know, what you gotta do, what you gotta do. Gotta get to that money. All right, we got the, all the black hoodies right here. Then we got red and, and some more black at the bottom. Purple, blue, gray, more black, red. We had a lot of pink, but we finna ship all of them off. Then it's more blue at the bottom. So we got some baby blue. We got baby blue in here. All of these, y'all. We got so much stuff that I'm like, this all pre-made. We just ready to drop it. We, we just ordered like 500 more hoodies too. So we finna have a good next few months. Hopefully. And yo, it look messy here, but we're gonna get it cleaned up. Sometimes we gotta open these up and check the size, cause our manufacturer be playing, bro. Like he'll put the wrong size or just don't put a size. Like, look, let me show y'all. You open this up. Oh shit, I'm stupid, it's right there. But yeah, sometimes he don't be putting the size on there. This one, it was a size. I just didn't see it. But y'all make sure y'all be checking y'all hoodies, man. They be playing. We got some kid sizes in y'all. This is a youth large, this is an adult small. Y'all can see the difference. 
the logo is way smaller on this one. We did that on purpose because they gonna be smaller. They don't want a big logo across their chest, you know? This one 13 inches wide. I think this one like 10. All right, so we just packed a whole bunch of orders. We got one, two, three, four boxes. All these orders from today before like five o'clock. It's like 9.30 right now, so we gotta drop these off in the morning. It took like three hours, so it'll take a long time, you feel me? But we working, we do this like every day. All right, look, bro. If y'all gonna have a brand, if you watching this and you got a brand, bro, make sure y'all add stuff that'll make the customer experience better. So for us, we give away stickers where every order, I'm talking about like, it don't matter what you order, we're gonna give you a sticker. And then also, we got some certificates on the way that we making. Uh, it's just like a certificate of authenticity authenticity how you say it bruh uh it just make it feel like y'all know how StockX send you the card with the owner signature and stuff like that it just make you feel appreciated and it's gonna make your customers want to come back and then we're gonna have custom bags and custom poly mailers like this it's gonna have our detox logo on here and then yo so on our receipt on our shipping on our packing labels we got our little logo right here if y'all need help on how to do that just dm me and I'll show you how. That's another thing. Instead of just showing your store. And then also we got a little thank you card that we put in here. It tell them how to wash. It got our socials on there. And got a little discount for their next order on there. So it's just little stuff like that. That's going to keep your customers coming back. Because really they going to run your business for you. You feel me? If they just keep coming back. That way you don't got to try to win over no new customers. I just be chilling in here, bro. Like I be in here hours just chilling. You got everything I need in here, you feel me? I just, I really, I wish I could have like electricity in here. I can have a little refrigerator in here and stuff like that. It would be real cool, you feel me? This is how y'all supposed to start flexing on people in 2023, shipping labels. Cause all of these worth like $65, these $65 bills. Everybody who subscribes to me, I'm gonna make sure y'all, y'all know what y'all are doing. You feel me? Y'all gonna be up just like this too. And I'm chasing a meal by the end of the year. Well, I'm chasing 500 by the end of the year. A meal by next year around this time. We're gonna see how that go for sure. One thing I learned with this clothing brand stuff, y'all, y'all gotta take y'all time. Cause like, I've been, for the past two months, I've been dropping twice a month. And I made 40K each month, which is good. But at the same time, bro, I'm all over the place. I'll be stressed out every day. Cause that's just too much, to be honest. And I wanna, I wanna be able to get to the point where I can drop comfortably twice a month. But right now, I realized like I can't even do that without being stressed out every day and having customers blowing up my phone and stuff like that. So I'm gonna just start dropping like whenever I feel comfortable dropping, you know, instead of just trying to be on a, a tight schedule. You don't have to do, you ain't gotta drop twice a month if you don't want to. If you can't, you know, you wanna be comfortable. But like now I'm gonna try, it's today's like April 24th, I think. I'm gonna try to drop like March 14th. My last drop was April 14th. So I'm gonna give myself a whole month to just get everything organized. I got custom bags on the way, uh, certificates. I got all type of stuff that I wanna do. So I need to, I need to give myself some time to be ready, you feel me? So y'all don't gotta feel rushed or nothing, you know, cause ain't nobody rushing you when you're an entrepreneur. You can make your own money whenever you want to. So I, I y'all just gotta pace yourself. And that's one thing I'm having to learn right now. Because I ain't perfect. I'm teaching y'all stuff that I know, but I ain't perfect. I'm learning a lot too, you feel me? I'm trying to change my whole brand image right now. I'm in the process of that because we've been doing a lot of pre-orders lately. But I think pre-orders are too stressful for the customers because they don't, you start to lose trust and stuff. And people want their stuff fast. You know, they want it just like they shop it online, but you want to make it to where they going to get it in a day or two, you feel me? So I'm doing everything pre-made from now on. No more pre-orders except kid sizes because I can't do my kid sizes right now because I'm still trying out that market and I don't want to order too many and then not sell. So, but for the, for all the regular stuff I sell, it's going to be pre-made from now on. I just think that's way easier, you know, especially since I got some cash built up now, I don't have to do a pre-order no more because I already got capital to buy my own stuff. Pre-orders is for when you first starting out, y'all. That's the only time I recommend it because I kept doing it after that. And it, it really, it's kind of damaged my company a little bit because people think that we might not ship stuff out now after it's been like two or three weeks. And then if your manufacturers have any delays, they just add on to it. So I just don't like pre-orders no more.